Hi everybody. I wanted to have another heart to heart with you. And it's about really trusting that everything is exactly the way it's supposed to be. I think a lot of people who don't have that intrinsic trust that everything is the way it's supposed to be are having a hard time right now. And I was writing a friend this morning. She lives on an Indian reservation in New Mexico. And she is a lover of spirit, as I am. And um, most Native people refer to God as Great Spirit, but she happens to be a Christian. So it doesn't matter what word you call the sacred mystery of life, but to really trust it is what I'm talking about today. So I'm in front of a painting of mine, and I'd like to explain it to you. It's actually a portrait of the whole shebang. It's God as an anthropomorphic figure, this big figure here. And we are all connected here as illuminated souls who are all of the same consciousness as the sacred is. Some of us don't know it, but some of us work with that energy. And that energy is yoga. That's why I love yoga so much. Not the fierce, you know, really extreme postures. I'm 